Bonanza sirens are going off. Go seek shelter. Lowest level. Interior room. Just say it. It is a trimmer, not a weed whacker. Definitely not a weed whacker. Weed eater? E either a weed eater or a trimmer. Not a weed whacker. No. I always laughed when people called it a weed whacker. I don't know why. I mean, I trim with, I trim, like when I use it, I don't just hit weeds. I, I trim grass too. It's not called a grass whacker, you know? <laughs> How about a whiffer sniffer? Whipper sniffer? Yeah, I've heard it called that too. Whiffer sniffer or whipper, whiffer, whatever it is. Like, no, it's a string trimmer or a, yeah, I don't know. Oh man. Yep. Lowest level interior room. Digger or cultivator? Cultivator. I really want a basement. You want a basement? Yep. I don't know why. But I always thought it would be way cool to have a basement that had nothing in it. And you filled it with water and you had your own like swimming pool underneath your house or not filled, but like, you know, a couple feet of water. Indoor pool. Yeah. Like just <laughs> in your basement. Well, yeah, if you put a liner in it and I guess you could. Yeah. <laughs> Is this going to be grass again down here in uh, two? Uh, two. Yes. Okay. I'm going to fertilize mm. it. I was, yeah, I was about to say it needs to get fertilized. Yep. Yep. Uh, if the tornado is going to be at your house in two minutes, please uh, make sure you're being safe. Seek hmm. shelter. If you're watching on your phone. Take it with you. Yeah, I think he is in his basement, though, which is good. Yep. All right. Tom, did you go refill? Nope, 9%, 8%, oh. Oh boy. Getting down there. What are we planting in the other field? I don't know. Hmm. If it's not, I mean, we might as well just do corn, I guess, right? Keep our fields the same. Wow, first time. Wow. Yeah, record it from your basement, of course. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Get spiders in the pool in the basement? I mean, probably. You should see the amount of spiders that get in Casey's pool like during the summer. It's outdoors. Crazy. It's always full of spiders. Casserole rocks. Casserole. We've been through this, my guy. It's a casserole. Wow, first. Tiny's rocking to be. Holy cow. First time or whatever I'm supposed to call you. Holy cow. A uh, hot dish is what they call it, like up north. Which actually, I believe a hot dish has red meat in it. A casserole does not. So it's a tuna casserole, not a tuna hot dish. Okay. End of story. So they make a hot dish and some tapioca, eh? Yes. Definitely. They're tapioca. Most definitely, Matt. Oh, it's raining in, like, downtown right now. Look at that. Nothing out here yet. Yeah. I think we're actually on the other side of it today. I think it might be like southeast of us. You know? We might be okay. Hopefully. Pro. All right. Pro tip from an amateur here. Uh, don't come in somebody else's chat and say, let's vote on what game I should stream. Probably shouldn't say that. 
Just letting you know. Yeah. Indoor pool, let's go. They probably shouldn't say that. Yeah. Put a, just put an indoor hot tub in, John. Dude, I can put one right behind me. Yeah. There's room. You never know, too. Yeah, turn you never your, know. Just turn your AC off and go. Oh, I'd be so hot in here, like so fast. Yeah. Get yeah, sauna and a hot tub in one. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Dude, I walked out here Sunday after coming home from the farm, and it was like 90... 192 degrees out here and uh it was kind of warm kind of warm all i right, turned john it's all yours what what <laughs> you're coming back i turned the air on and went in the house for like an hour came back out here it was like 70 degrees <laughs> great factor seven am i coming back <laughs> Yeah. You want it, Tom? Am I coming back? I mean, if not, get out and I'll take that planner, you know? Just saying. I'm like somebody that's about to go with a group of aliens to a distant planet. Am I coming back? <laughs> you going to Mars with Elon? Oh. Uh, something like that. Maybe they have better Wi-Fi up there. Yeah, they probably have better internet. So we can understand you. About the Devil's Tower, Wyoming. <laughs> Well, I'll have Starlink internet, so it'll be great. He is just asking for people to go to his stream. Yes, that's what he's doing. Absolutely. I'm not stupid, you know? Okay. We all know this, yeah. And that's not how you get viewers, no. Not at all. That's honestly how you get banned from people's chats, so. Yeah. That's how you get banned. Yep, the hammer has come out, chat. Let's see it. Let's see that band hammer. Yeah, I mean, I never went to anybody else's chat and was like, hey, my name is John. Come follow me. Not how you grow on Twitch. Not how you grow. That's how you make enemies more than anything, honestly. So, yeah. Uh, we're in good shape right now. We're just seeding. Seeding away. Waste your ban request, even though you already did, but you know. Oh, did he? Yeah. He already did an unban request, huh? Yeah. Man, that's fast. These people Gotta are on. Record. Yeah, these people are on their unban request here lately. I'm kidding. That's great. Let me guess. It got denied. <laughs> nah, it's still sitting there. I'm, I think I'm, I'm too busy in game to too busy, okay. Yeah. yeah. I could tell you what I'm gonna select, but you know. Yeah. Yeah, apparently. I'll give you a hint. He's a keyboard warrior over there, you know? Uh, it's gonna say decline. Relax, or whatever the deny is. I don't know what it actually says. It says, like, denied. I've never gone and looked at an unbanned request. I never go to the, uh, what's it called? So, what's it called? Odd view? Is that what it's called? I think so. Ban this green arcade guy. I don't want to talk <laughs> about my cars with extended warranty. <laughs> Just saying. I want to talk about it. What can you offer? Like, what's what's the warranty? Has anybody actually like, ever asked them what the warranty actually is? That's usually a robot. Oh, that's unfortunate. I oh, you? Talk to them. They want me to oh. press buttons, and I don't want to press buttons. No, don't press buttons. Oh, I got you, Carson. It's an ongoing joke, huh? Yeah. All right. Have fun. Have a good day. That no, was an ongoing joke. <laughs> nope. <laughs> right? 
Aren't they about to like forgive student loans or something like that? I don't know. I'll take mine in twenties, please. They were talking about that, like forgiving all student loan debt. Oh my. Kinda crazy. On like a government stimulus type thing. Where are they getting all this money from? You know? I mean they just keep on printing it. That's not how well, it works, Trent. Okay. It comes from us. True. In taxes. Actually that's how it works that's right now. Not how it works. Nope. The dollar is not backed by gold anymore. Yeah. So tornado warnings, am I right? There's still a lot of them too. There's even one in Canada. Oh no. Bill? Bill, seek shelter. Bill? Oh yeah, get, get your bag of milk and go hide. <laughs> Gotta get, get the maple syrup. I like Fire Shadow's message. <laughs> oh. Yeah. oh man. Yeah, guys, let's not get into government talk, okay? I appreciate it. Yeah, it's Tornado hard. in the Czech Republic the other day, really? Dude, it did some damage. Did it really? Oh, yeah. Wait, the Czech Republic. So I did not what hear about that. It's in the Czech Republic. That's where it's at. Del Carson. Come on, idiot. Is that where Prague I is? I think so. Maybe. I don't know. I've never been there. Never left the country, so I don't know. One of them. Never left the country. Probably never will. Honestly. I've been to California. Uh, yeah, you, you basically left the country. You've left the country <laughs> then, the yeah. Same thing, yeah. Yeah, pretty well. <laughs> Which, what, did, what did Matt go to California for? What was what was Matt doing in California? Hmm. Can you say? <laughs> Sounds like a good, uh, good time for some guesses. Getting cancer. Lock it in. No. Nope. I got it. I know it. Pizza? There was a pizza convention, and Matt was there. <laughs> I could see it. Yep. Could I see, see it. it. <laughs> yep. Definitely. Yep. You know what? That sounds good for dinner, actually. It actually really does, but we're probably not getting it. Yeah. You're getting canes, huh? Dude, the Hell. past, like, two or three Sundays, Dad will be like, how, how about this for dinner? Or he's like, what do you want for dinner? And don't say pizza. And every <laughs> time when he says that, I'm like, all I want now is pizza. Like, you... So, like, last week they were trying to get, like, Cracker Barrel. They ended up at Denny's because Cracker Barrel closes at, like, 8 o'clock or something. 9 o'clock, whatever. Yeah. We were kind of late last week coming home. And I just, I ordered myself a pizza. <laughs> like, you go to Disney, Matt? At no. Denny's? I might be going next year. Really? To the opposite side of the U.S., but. Florida? Yeah. Are you turning into a Disney adult? Um... I don't know. <laughs> you know, you get like all the pins and everything. Like, it might be a free trip. So, oh, well then. Yeah. I mean, I could see that. Here's your plus one. <laughs> Ooh, I gotta find a plus one. Wait, you need a plus one? <laughs> yep. How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> hey. How you doing? <laughs> Yes, Rox, you have left the country twice if you went to California twice, sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah, why not? Yeah, I've been out of the country a lot if you include all those times, too. Sheesh. So you got, like, a like a, like a a work trip in the... Uh... No, it's, it's, a, it's a brother trip with the niece. That will be four. Oh. oh. Yeah, be four, so. I gotcha. Okay. A little birthday trip, huh? Maybe. Legoland. Yeah, probably a birthday trip. That'd be cool. Are you going to listen to Dora all the way? <laughs> uh, <laughs> like they, I used to have a follow, by the way. Welcome in. How's it going? For the record, my nephew was like two and it was Chicago. But that's another story. Oh. No, I don't trip. know what I just did. Awful. That tractor, but it's in its new parking spot. You flipping tractors again? No. Why would I do that? Come on. Who do you think I am? 
farming is great we did a ton of alfalfa we're actually waiting for midnight to see how much we get paid we sold it all to bga uh alfalfa silage so we're uh we're interested no to see so we're gonna get this planting done here and then we're gonna go plant field nine Matt's probably going to find a tree or two to cut down because, you know, that's what Matt does. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we'll be good to go. We'll say I'm only cutting trees where there's places to mow. Okay. Hide the, hide the moors from Matt, okay, guys? Hide the moors. <laughs> <laughs> I think we need to sell the Brux chip or two. Ah, be all right. Ah, uh, Brux is, like, good. Life. You see that uh, little thing they released in the mod hub that kind of looks like a Brooks Chipper? Somebody was talking about that the other day that, like, it's on console too, right? Yeah, yeah but it only holds, like, 25,000. I think it's 20,000. But does it work like the Brooks? Like, no, I heard it's kind of lowish. Dog water. Dog water, yep. Wouldn't surprise me, you know? It's just planting over the freshly grown corn. Yep, that's me. Destroy it. Start over. I mean, our Brux here can deploy a tree and stump. At an alarming rate, too. Uh-huh, and they're pretty nice. Favorite car or truck in Farming Simulator? Uh, a tractor. I don't like trucks. I mean, semi-trucks, yeah, but... Like, the pickups, I don't think they have a place in Farm Sim, honestly. I don't, I don't use them for anything. First thing we usually do on a map is sell it. Actually, we did that on here. Yes, you're rich yeah, and we did. thunder around. Yeah, you could get a thunder thunder creek uh, fuel thingy, but we have a, a fuel on our header cart for our combines, so plus all of our fields are like right here. Tom, we done yet? Um, we're getting there. Oh no, is Matt yeah. mowing right now? No, I yeah. just finished fertilizing. Okay, I was like, oh no, no, no. <laughs> I just finished fertilizing. <laughs> Matt goes all over. Cut. Matt goes over all over God's green earth from mowing. Huh? Like I see green, I mow it. Be following a trail of marshmallows. Oh boy. Oh goodness. All the trail of Stay Puffed. <laughs> Stay Puff was here. Can't wait for that movie. It does dumps and trees, but it's really slow. Okay. That's better than nothing for consoles. Yeah. Better than what they've had, which is potato. Nothing. Dog water. Nothing. So. Like, here we go oh. as we slowly pat you on the shoulder. Yeah. This thing just chug a lugs up this hill. Five miles per hour. <laughs> I knew that was coming. Am I an international <laughs> harvester? Come on, you got a, the biggest tractor in the game. Come on. Yeah, chug a lug's nine mile an hour up that hill. Chug a lug a lug. Should be five, right? <laughs> Could be eight, though, Tom. Yeah, unless what you roll it. Nothing. Uh-oh. What do you do? Tractor over. No. I didn't roll it. Might as well change oil. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Where's he at? Nowhere. At the house. Oh. Oh. Oh, that one. <laughs> I don't think the oil would run out of it, Matt. <laughs> yeah, you put a bucket under the front right row there. Be right. I, mm, that's where the plug is, you know. You might have to drain it out the filler cap. <laughs> <laughs> the check cap. Yeah. <laughs> Fire Shadow, time to go grocery shopping. Have fun with that, my guy. We'll catch you later. Have a good one. Holy cow. Meta 8305 just resubscribed for two months. Yo. What up, job? Thanks for the resub for two months with the Prime. Holy Hannah Montana, appreciate it. Welcome back. Mater, appreciate it, appreciate it. How's it going? Are you Toe Mater's long lost brother? Toe Mater. Uh -huh. <laughs> I 
Thanks for the host. Appreciate it. The timing Thank of that was pretty good. Yes. You know? Yeah, that's what I was laughing at, yeah. The timing <laughs> was impeccable. Thanks for that follow as well. Appreciate it. Welcome in. How's it going? Holy Hannah Montana. Probably let Tom do one more round and get it, but I'm going to, you know, be a team player here. Getting it. Wyoming, we don't back stuff in. You don't, yeah. Don't back your drivable in. That way when you tab, all you see is a shed. You pull it in, you see the tractor. It's Almost the house. Is. Oh, but I like seeing the shed. I don't. Yeah, it kind of gets annoying. No, it's kind of like one of my pet peeves about farm sim, honestly. But yeah, well, Mrs. It Professor, it's going. How are things where you're at? We saw your Discord post. <laughs> oh my god. Thanks for the host as well. Appreciate it. Welcome in. You okay there, Carson? Mm hmm. Are you sure? Oh, I'm. Yes, indeed. All right. John from Puma Fly, though. I'm great. Just keeping an eye on the weather, you know? You know what sounds really good right now? Food? Pizza. Don't talk about pizza. Pizza sounds good. You're not going to get it? Rude. Matt, did you have pizza today? Carson, shut up. I have not. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't Matt, have pizza today? Wait, Matt you hasn't had pizza? Go get pizza? I haven't what? had pizza. I need to go get some probably tomorrow. What? Do you have out. any in the freezer? When was the last time you oh. had a piece of pizza? Uh, Thursday, so. Oh my god, how are you still alive? I don't know, I had barbecue. Oh. Barbecue sandwiches. Dude, Why barbecue pizza. Out of the freezer. Ooh. Once you get to the end, John, fold it on up and bring it on back home. Well, barbecue pizza. That is good, Mrs. Professor. I'm glad to hear it. Glad you guys are okay for now. Good. When are we gonna play Rust again? Oh, might be a while. Might be a while. Wow. Oh, eight. Seven. I can't believe you go that slow. Man, you would have been done forever ago if you were able to keep speed, huh? <laughs> hey, you might get done before noon. Really? There, I'm back Barely. at 11. My cruise control wasn't working for whatever reason. All right. I'll probably get pizza tomorrow for my dinner. Family can get whatever they want. See, they don't like what I order either. I, I get like Little Caesars. I, I love their thin crust. I'm on a I'm on a kick here lately of Little Caesars thin crust. Oh. Mr. Runscore so Professor 85 just resubscribed for 31 months. So many months, so little time. Wow, <laughs> oh wow. Oh yeah, we have that first thing going too. Uh, Professor, thank you so much for the 31 months of tier two. Much appreciate it. Glad you guys are doing like it's okay out there right now. That is a good thing. Saw that picture your wife posted there. It was kind of freaky, not gonna lie. And you know, I'm sitting over here in Missouri. Or it's kind of scary over there. With wildfire right down the road, that's not good. Not good, but I do appreciate the resub. I'm going to go get pizza for dinner, so I'll be back. All right, Carson. Carson, I finished up before noon. All because really? John helped. <laughs> it is because I helped you. All right, now it's noon. I think we just, it's, it's, it's lunch, right? Pizza. Why don't, wait, come on. I'll, pe I'll pizza you guys later. See you, Carson. I didn't think he'd ever leave. He's not gone, though. That's the thing. <laughs> This uh, field looks great out here, Matt. Very shiny. Yep. Oh, we're were we doing nine and corn as well? Uh, yes, sir. All right, I'll be on my way. I'll take yeah. the hilly part, okay? I'll go up north to the hilly part. Right. you wood chip thieves what Drain stole my wood chips <laughs> again 
Hmm. Oh, goodness. I finally got all these trees out of here. Yeah, Professor. Makes sense, yeah. I haven't had to cut grass and I cut the farm last week. Probably shouldn't have. But it's been raining like cats and dogs here, so. Yeah. We're starting to, um, I wouldn't say get nervous, but Dad and I are watching the river forecast very closely. Because, uh, it could be bad here soon. So we are watching very closely. It depends on how much rain areas get in the next couple days. If we can get through, like, Tuesday, Wednesday without another big rain event between now and then, which doesn't sound very likely, uh, we would be in pretty good shape because that river would get to come back down a little. But uh, I don't I don't know if that's going to happen. Well, I mean, thanks for coming in, buddy. We'll catch you. Appreciate it. Just don't know about the rivers right now. The one river. Not the other one. I need the train doesn't show up in Inspector Mod. Uh, I bet it does in single player. Uh, you know, you can tab to it in single player. Yeah. So, it might. I don't know. It'd be kind of cool if it would. How much does it have? I dumped it back there in that green rail silo thing. Oh. Mr. Underscore Professor 85 cheered X400. Haven't been around lately. So crazy busy at work and home. I got you, Professor. Well, I appreciate you making some time to come in and hang out. It, it has been a while. You, you guys have, uh, somebody was asking about you guys the other day. Even. I can't remember who it was. Somebody was asking. Thanks for the biddies, though. Appreciate them, sir. As always. Yeah, so hopefully we don't have to do flood prep, but... I was talking about my dad last night and he was like kind of grumbling about maybe having to do it and i bet we clean up a little bit sunday like there tomorrow uh at the farm i bet we do a little bit of cleanup just to clean up you know and i said well it'll be a whole lot easier this time because there's still like a ton of stuff that we never got back out of the loft from uh 2019 different tillers and lawnmowers and all kinds of hand tools and all kinds of stuff that we just haven't needed since then are we've needed but we just make do with something else you know and like our sandblasting cabinet it's still upstairs we haven't used it since 2019 so a lot of that stuff's already done so it it wouldn't be fun to have to do it again but it wouldn't be as bad as uh, last time the thing that would really suck is we have more well, last time we had those wagons and we put our disc and our uh, brush hog on those and set them out at the neighbor's like high spot. Well, we don't have those wagons anymore. I guess we'd just set them out there without the wagon. I'm sure they'd be nice enough to let us like borrow some high spot land again. Hey, Matt's cutting trees down. Huh? I can tell. <laughs> So that'll be uh, an adventure because tetanus on wheels. We're not letting that go through a flood. No, no, no. That's going to go out to the high spot. We put new new wheel bearings in and stuff, so we don't want that. Uh, disc. The plow can sit because we don't use it anyway. The more, obviously, the brush hog. The disc or the harrow thing, we'll probably just put that up on blocks. Or maybe put that on top of like the, where the house used to be at the farm. I don't know. I don't want to. I don't want to do any of that. I just. It's not fun. It's not fun at all. And and all of our pumpkins are looking great too. So it'd really be a shame if we got a flood right now. By the time we got back in and everything, we'd probably be. Uh, probably be past the time where we could actually plant pumpkins. That would kind of suck. From Brazil. Well, welcome in Brazil. How's it going? You could use the landscaping tool to raise your farm. <laughs> okay, Matt. Yeah, Professor, there were some really big storms. Uh, around here, it didn't do that. It laid out a bunch of corn. Uh, there are some fields that are 
pretty well flat, but it's not like not like cold the corn star bad last year. It wasn't it's not quite that bad here, but it's still pretty gnarly, so yeah. Oh yeah, Mrs. Professor. Yeah. You thought there was an air show. Oh. Yeah, no, Mrs. Professor, I got you. Yeah. Fire's got to be really a scary thing, huh? <laughs> the lightning, you thought I was doing gymnastic trials, huh? By the way, lightning, we need to have a chat, buddy. You need to quit striking all around me, okay? I've had to unplug my computers the past like two or three nights now because of you. Just want you to be aware, you know? So yeah, just want you to be aware that uh, I've been, I'm, yeah, mm -hmm. I'm behind on rendering, behind on uploading, all because of you, Lightning. You don't need to hang out around here that much, you know? I mean, I don't mind if you hang out, just not, not too close, you know? Keep your distance. <laughs> don't hurt my computers, okay? Just saying. I would appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks for attending my TED talk. <laughs> oh boy. We're playing Where's Waldo with Matt right now. Where in the world is Matt cutting down trees? <laughs> I could sell that land back. I would. I can't. <laughs> because there's placeables on it. And it won't let us. Oh, that's funny though. Lightning, get it together, man. <laughs> get it together, Lightning. At least you've left me alone today so far, you know? Didn't calm here today. Last night, two nights ago, oh boy. There was one where I, like, the house shook and everything. Like, it was, it was close. And based on that radar maps, uh, like the map thing, it was nowhere near me, but it totally was. On a weird. All right, so midnight tonight, all of our alfalfa is gonna sell, and a couple grass bales that we made over there too, our haylage or whatever they were. There's gonna be quite a bit. The question is, how much money are we gonna make off that? That is the question. Hopefully enough for Matt can stop cutting down trees. Apparently we sold milk. When did we do that? Interesting. I don't remember doing that. What's wrong with cutting down trees? <laughs> the lag. Oh, the lag. Eh, it's a little bit. It's It was worse on uh, Griffin. <laughs> Yeah. Griffin, it was terrible on there. Good enough we broke it. Yeah. Which time? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we kind of broke Griffin, like, at least twice, didn't we? Mm -hmm. For sure. Holy cow. All right. Thanks, Lightning. I, unfortunately, actual Lightning, not, like, uh, going to be probably till at least next Friday here. They're talking a pretty good chance of a thunderstorm every day till at least next Friday. So it's like, it just doesn't stop around here, you know? Crazy. Which is why we could have issues with a uh, flood. So really hope that doesn't happen. Well, it looks like that storm is coming even closer now. <laughs> That was the best moment with lightning, yeah. All right, cussed and everything. Uh, uh, rocks, yeah. I did. I dropped an F-bomb live on stream. It happens. Not very often, but it does. <coughs> Not very often. Yes, yeah, so I guess with the storm, they're saying uh, 60 mile an hour winds. 
All right. Uh, we're going to harvest the corn in this corn and sell it. We don't need any silage. We have a whole bunch of chaff in storage. Uh, we did chaff like our first day on the map. And we are, uh, we're good. We don't need any for a while. So we got plenty to last. At least as far as I know. I haven't checked lately, so. Probably should check since we have all this corn planted, huh? Probably wouldn't hurt. So yeah, we'll check. But basically, this is a uh, far profit corn. Uh, let's go around here. At least that's the theory. Um, I think he might get it all in the next pass, by the way. If not, I'm here, but... He might. Be real he close. Should. Real close. We will see. Definitely need another combine, though. Hugger wagon. 3.2. 3.2. Three point two. Oh, million. I don't know why you're stuck on that number. Just I don't random know. guess. Yeah. yeah. Roger that. Oh come on, GPS. Yes. Like what are you doing? Come on. Oh, you gotta buy them by like four rows. And maybe like two. <laughs> but you got it. That's all that matters. Yeah. Just saying. Good to go. Alright. Carson was here. That clip would have been played by now. Yeah, he's off getting pizza making everybody jealous. I bet you I get a snap about his pizza too. Yeah, I'll bet. Hunting Kings, what's going on? Hey, but at least we get Farm Sim 22 on November 22nd. Wait, what? What about November? November 22nd, we get Farm Sim 22, so it'll all be alright. Okay. So Carson making me jealous that he has pizza will be okay because we get Farm Sim in November? Yes. I'm not seeing the logic there, but we'll go with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, it all makes sense. Thank you, Tom. Not at all. That's what makes sense right there. Running Carson over. Let's go. That took a turn. I did take a turn right at Carson. Yeah. <laughs> you mean do it again? Look, I'm taking a turn right at Carson. <laughs> oh, that time you went over my tractor. <laughs> Are my hydraulics okay back there? Are said you're not supposed to stand that close to the tractor if the PTO if the engine's on you, the PTO might get you. <laughs> He's not even here. Oh, I heard that thunder. Uh oh. Uh -oh I have no idea what he's getting for dinner. As far as I know, pizza. Do you want the Great Plains parked in the open shed? Or I don't the shed? care where you put it. Probably one of the big sheds because it's kind of too long. For the other sheds? Uh, we'll probably play at least one more map between now and 22, if not two more maps. Play, we don't. Maps don't usually last us very long. Oh, Griffin did. Griffin did, but beyond that, maps don't really oh. last us like a long amount of time. Oh, we broke it and fixed it. Yeah. But usually, yeah, maps don't last us like months and months and months usually. So we have like five months. We'll probably go at least one more map after this one. At least, you yeah. know. 
All right, should I get the same OP combine or should I get something else? Should we get an X9? Whatever you want to do. Probably should keep it OP, just, you know. Put the European markers on here. Just to annoy everybody. Yeah. Cool tracks, why not? Four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Goodness me. All right, remember we're waiting for midnight to see how much money we uh, will be getting for all of our bales. Yeah, and rocks. We really should go back and do it, but at the same time, I kind of don't have any motivation. You know. Whoa. What was that? My cat fell off the chair again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Interesting. Kind of scared me a little bit. Uh, okay. I have a 60 foot header and case red. Uh, do I know what map? No. Uh, usually we don't, uh, we don't pick maps until we're like, I don't even really, I don't look at maps anyway, until I'm like ready to go. And most of the time, I don't even look at maps. I just kind of trust what the guys are saying. So, usually, uh, Matt. Whatever Matt says. A lot of times, I'm in. So, yeah. All right. All right, remember, midnight, 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 midnight. How much money will we end up with, guys? Besides a lot. I don't love just being able to like buy a brand new combine, you know. Uh, thanks for the foul. How's it going? Welcome on in, guys. What's going on today? Hope y'all are having a good day. Everybody staying safe from that weather out there. Tornadoes and fires and lions and tires and bears and my. Holy cow. That's got to rain again, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Like real life. Just like real life. Million bucks rocks. Hopefully. Hopefully it's more than that. If we didn't use course play for that, we would that would take us forever. Course play definitely helped us out with that whole thing quite a bit. Power through it. Power through that person up there. Mm-hmm. Yep. Here we go. Run them over. All right. Waiting for midnight. We sold this entire big field up here. This whole blob was alfalfa. And most of it, there was some that didn't get wrapped. Most of it was baled and wrapped. And sold as like alfalfa haylage or alfalfa lidge or whatever it was. I don't know what you actually call it. Oh, yeah, comes the rain. Oh boy. That's good. Got a new shiny combine to break in. Zero hours. Let's go. Two of them is going to be great. Once we get our GPS locked in, we'll be good to roll. Oh, I do want to get an auger wagon too, don't I? Yeah. Yeah. But really, with these combines, you kind of don't need one, but it'd be nice. And we really don't have one that'll, uh, we don't have any like edited ones. So 70,000 is all we get. Why did I just buy that in blue? I should have changed that color, huh? <laughs> should have made it red. That's all of our, or no, Fent, Fent green. We'll change. Maybe we'll change it. All right, midnight's almost here. Almost midnight. Kinda not really. Never mind. We're getting there.
Okay. Find a place to park this green head. Go park it in that shed with that other one. A little thunder. You know, there's thunder in this game, but there's no lightning. Like flashes of lightning. Five point one million dollars. Wow. Almost five point two mil. Holy cow. We just break the map. Nah. Uh, I think so, because it hasn't updated our cash. <laughs> That's on your screen, homie. Okay. Wait, Tomcat, what is that? That looks like a problem there, Tomcat. Holy cow. That's a lot of money. And I was thinking only 3.2. Yeah. Five point, basically two million dollars. But I guess I also did say somewhere north of three point two. Wow. Just didn't think that far north. That's crazy amount of money. Wow. Do we have all that done, Rice? I don't, I didn't remember all that, but I still have, I think I have the save and all the mods on uh, Google Drive still. I think. I don't know. On one hand, I want to go finish it, but on the other hand, uh, I don't. So, yeah. I don't know. I'm changing my idea. I don't want to go over here. Actually, we should start there and then, yeah, run from there. Okay. Fine. Unlike driving a combine in the rain. Hey, look at that. The wiper even works. Kind of hyper, too. I know hyper. You can see a lot with the corn head on the front. <laughs> Said no one ever. This is Pine Cove by Stevie. Not to be confused with a pine nut. <laughs> I'm just going to keep calling back to earlier, you know, earlier things in the stream. Trent, you like out. He did, didn't he? Yep. Wind Starlink, not soon enough. On tractor back out. Let's go. Tommy, you want to grab the other gunman? Get that set up or Matt, one of you guys? Yeah, I'll be over there in just a minute. All right, I'm going to change the color on the soccer wagon because it looks ugly. Uh, I said ugly. Uh, oh, I said it. Make it fent green. Match. Our fat tractors. Uh, fat. There we go. Much better. That looks like a John Deere, but it's a fat. It's a fat. Wind Starlink. Star, maybe he doesn't know he's back. Trans back. But. Oh, he muted. Oh, hello. There's a shed there. Who put that shed there? I Trent. Not soon enough, right? Correct. <laughs> I'm serious, man. I'm very tempted. It's like, I don't have to deal with Spectrum anymore on, well, I'd still have Spectrum, but yeah. Won't have to deal with them as much? I mean, if it's like reliable and like all the numbers are really, really good for what I, what I do, I could see getting rid of Spectrum and just having them. 
Like, if it's that good. That is an if, you know? I'm hoping it's that good. But we will have to wait and see. Yeah, it looks like our fields are ready. We can stop our time. Oh. I just heard some thunder. That or it was a car accident. I'm not sure. Or was that a gunshot or a firework? Never know. Thunder. Feel the thunder. Lightning and the thunder. How did I hear thunder? Ain't no thunder near me at all. No lightning. Well, that's the same way with me. I, it's like nowhere near me yet, and I still heard it. Plus it's, I mean, it was kind of fun the other night watching the lightning map and then being like, wait, 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 I could hear it. And like, it was nowhere near me, and I could hear it. It was pretty cool. It was pretty neat. Ready. I'm going to leave this here truck just over here yonder somewhere pointing downhill so we can accelerate faster. Oh, I'm going to go fill up my water bottle. I'll be back. All right. Call me and row Randy. Or something like that. As thunder rolls. That's right, Ross. I've said that way too many times this week already. I think that's what that was. I just kind of faintly hear it off in the distance to my right, so. I don't know. It was very faint, though, I will tell you that. Very, very faint. Maybe it's the lightning that you can hear, Trent. Wait, we live like three hours away from each other. Never mind. Well, I mean, I, I heard the thunder because it shook the house. Oh. Oh, that's real. Uh huh. I actually kind of miss so like when you know when I was growing up, we had like crappy single pane, like all wood windows that were kind of junk, you know. And so the glass would rattle. I kind of miss like a good thunderstorm and hearing that glass rattle. We have like vinyl windows now. They don't rattle. It's just not the same, you know? It's not the same. Seems like that line that's coming towards me is just growing. Yeah. It's like a solid red line too. And it's like, eh. Oh boy. Sounds like fun. But if I do have to go in my cross space, all I have to do is roll up the window and I head like maybe a foot to my right. Crawl space? Yeah. Is that where you'd go if there was a Terminator? Uh, yeah. I said I never thought about a crawl space. I guess it would work, right? Oh, I, uh, go near the crib. Hmm. We saw always... one of those cribs with the, the concrete. Oh yeah. Always. Bottoms. Oh yeah. Always freaked me out being at the farm during a storm because there's nowhere to go. Oh yeah, that's like here. It's like that's eh, either you go underneath the house or. Yeah. Where, where do you go? Go crawl in the road ditch somewhere. What's your header width? Uh, uh don't know yet. I'm uh I'm just doing some end rows real quick. Uh, Trent, what's the header width on these corn heads? Uh, forty point zero five. Let's set up north south map. 40, 0, 5. How about that? Good. I'm going to set mine east-west just so it doesn't troll me because I know it's going to not work the first time. But yeah, John, the road, the two road ditches that are right across from our farmland, yeah. you basically park a car in the ditch and you probably wouldn't see it. So they're real deep. Yeah, I... and they're kind of wide too. Gotcha. Might be a good one. I mean, I guess if like we knew there was a storm coming and say we couldn't get back to town, I there's there's houses down there that have basements 
that sit like up on higher ground, you know, so they have basements. And uh, I mean, even the old farmhouse, I guess it had a cellar under under the kitchen. But, you know, we tore that down back in 05. And uh, so, I mean, I could go like two miles down the road and beat on somebody's door. And I, I know they'd let me in. I know who they are, you know. I mean, if it, if it was coming and we couldn't get back to town, I know where I would go. It'd be one of Zach's family members. Probably start at one. If they didn't answer, I'd go to another one. <laughs> Just keep going down the list, you know? Like, hey, let me in. <laughs> yeah, I say if I really wanted to or and, or and or had to, I'd just go to my stepdad's house that has a basement. Yeah, but how far away? Eh, it's like 10 or 15 miles. Yeah. But yep. in a way, I don't trust that house because it's like 100 plus years old. Yeah. Those are the best houses. Maybe. Wait, that width doesn't work at all, Trent. What'd you say? 4005? Yeah, that's what we, we I guess all it, remembered no, from Griffin. Mind. From the 16-row Capello. You're at, you're at, you're at. I come I wasn't quite lined up, you know? At first, but we're good. So they called out a smoke alarm not too far away. Right after a lightning hit. Hmm. How convenient. There's a lot of that. And there goes Trent again. I think that storm's a little close to Trent. Right now. In fact, I know it is. Let's see. He lives up that away. Because remember, we went over and kind of, kind of nearby Trent. We, we drove a couple hours. He drove a couple, like an hour. When we met up that time, I sold him that drone. Oh, yeah. Uh, Trent is in Illinois. I'm in Missouri. Illinois is not far, though. Yeah, you're good, Trent. You're good. Yeah, you probably didn't hear me, but my uh, my combine just wasn't lined up yet. But we're good. Live in Illinois. Nice. Yeah, so actually that time we went to meet Trent, we drove to KC, Illinois. Although some people, apparently I've heard lately it's not called KC, Illinois. It's called KZ or something I don't know uh, but that's where we went so Trent uh, he, you know, he had to drive a little over an hour we drove like two oh I'll drive back over there and look at it a minute I didn't pay attention to it Ben <laughs> Starling please hurry up right Mrs. Professor Champaign, Illinois. All right. Don't know that I've ever been there, but I've definitely heard of it. All right. Yeah, it was great. We, uh, I was actually that way, the way the whole like drone thing went down, I was talking about like, you know, I don't need this drone. I had a new drone and, uh, I think it was brought up like how much did I want for it? And next thing I know he like hit, hit up my PayPal. I was like, all right, I guess that means I get to meet Trent. <laughs> and we kind of worked it out where, like, we drove a couple hours. He drove a little ways. We met at a Casey's gas station. Actually, in a church parking lot next door to a Casey's. Uh, I flew the drone to make sure, you know, it was good to go. And then we, uh, you know, got some pizza, got some sodies, and said good day. We had to get back. Coming back this way because not two hours for us or so. Give or take a little bit. 
And uh, yeah, we were good to go. There was a deer uh, dealership there too, yeah. yeah. We drove around the little town for just a minute and we uh, got back on the highway and came on home. Pepper, how's it going? Do you survive your day of your busy day at work? Obviously, since you're here. Any update on that slide stuck in California, by the way? Uh, Pepper? Probably not, huh? Oh, yeah. Curious. Yeah, so that was us uh, going to Trevor. And then, like, you know, I was kind of... I wasn't nervous about it because, like, I talked to Trent and Team Speak a whole bunch and stuff. But still, I would say a little on edge because you don't know who you're meeting, you know? Trent's a nice guy and everything. No worries now. But, uh... I was a little freaked out, so my, my dad, we took dad's truck, and so dad was there, and then I made Zach go with us. I didn't make Zach. I offered if Zach wanted to go, and he said yes. And then my buddy Casey went with us, too. I was like, safety in numbers, boys. Come on. <laughs> Are you going to go out tonight yet, Pepper? Holy cow. Holy cow, buddy. Matt, these combines go forever, don't they? Mm hmm I don't know if I like the capacity, honestly. Because it's, like, not realistic. I kind of wouldn't mind, like, turning them down to what they should be. You no, know, then we have to empty all the time, but... Yeah. At least it's more realistic. And you know, I'm only at 50%. I'm only at 26. <laughs> and I've been cutting, I feel like, forever already. I did all the way across the bottom of the field twice, up this side, all the way over to where you cut, and all the way back now. That's 50%. Holy cow. Cut forever. Oh, yeah. No news there, Pepper? Okay. My dad ordered some uh, uh, drip irrigation like fittings and stuff from California. And this company, I guess, has no employees right now. And, uh, oh, the mountain, by the way, reflecting on the water. Yeah. That's what Stevie does for you right there, guys. Makes water look really good. Uh, but he finally got confirmation, and then the next day the package showed up at the house. It took like two and a half months. Or something crazy like that. Kind of insane. So, yeah. But at least we got the stuff. It actually worked out. We got it the other day and we need it, like, tomorrow. So. Yeah, that is good. And there's a boat. There's an orange speedboat out there. Just kind of, or whatever kind of boat you want to call that. Just getting it. That's Stevie for you. It actually runs, goes in this little, like, inlet here. Runs around an island. Pretty cool. It's pretty neat. Uh, this is not 4X, no. Oh, this is a Goldcrest edit from, uh, Goldcrest was 17, right? And this is a gold crest edit. But nope, not a 4X. They actually kind of avoid 4X maps now. I do, anyway, at least on the server. Um, they don't really... They don't run well, in my opinion. I hope that changes with 22, by the way. Got your uh, pepper. That's a big box. Come mine holds 120,000. 120. I really like 4X maps. I like the scale of them. I like the big farming. That's what we do a lot. We, we're big farmers. You know, we, you know, big Borgo cedars and big, big. Articulated tractors, like that's how I like to farm. 
60 foot grain heads we have now like they're great but rx maps tend to get uh too leggy on surfers for me so uh how many mods i think it's around 30 but not too many so yeah nebraska lands you like them but it feels too big gotcha i swear it's raining out there but i don't think it actually is sounds like it is i think so nebraska lands yeah I've, we've heard i've heard of that map i don't think i've ever been on it what was that one map where it was like four unique maps put into one uh almost Rusted, Tyler's taylor Rustic, Hawks. a farm something i would have liked to have played that one a lot longer than we did but it got so laggy yeah. it's going guys welcome in welcome on in kiwi kiwi was good kiwi was a fun map that's a uh what's his name Kaz. Kaz, yeah anything Kaz, I've, I've always liked his maps but there again they're 4x so they're hard to run on uh servers like kiwi got leggy uh what was, what was that other map we were talking about that one the other day the uh Oh God, uh, uh, Peasant Peasantville, Peasant Vale, Bill, Peasant Vale. That was the uh, 16, right? Mm -hmm. That one was awesome, but so laggy. If we could have just run like two people on there, it would have been great. <laughs> but it was it was too laggy. I recently just changed my uh, background. When I changed the space one, it still was from that map. I think it was Phil, wasn't it? That put out the bales um, and spelled hi, John. The cotton bales? Yes. Yeah, I still, I had that up until like a month ago. Yeah. Oh, the tribines? Yeah, we used to use those. Those were, those were something. Always reminded me of a puppy. But they just kind of flopped around, you know? What I always thought of them. They were good though. They were they were okay. All right, eighty percent pipe goes out. Beacons are already on. You know, let's go. Nobody to empty me. <laughs> All our help left to get pizza. Two of the four maps in Rustier in Mod Hub. I did not know that. Yeah. Did not know that. Rustic Acres and um, I want to say almost a farm. Interesting. I like what we did with that one. We did where we just made it like all one field. Mm -hmm. Eight hundred acres, roughly, or whatever it was. Yeah, because that map was literally four standard size maps that yeah. he stuck together. Yeah. And then put some interesting roads between them. Mm-hmm. Very, very interesting. That one was, like, real sketchy going down where we sold everything. Yeah, that was a great map. Enjoyed it. Basically, when we, like, move maps, it's usually because of lag. That's usually the reason like if a map starts getting real laggy or it starts crashing or or whatever that's usually when it's time to pull the trigger and go to something else for us yes mrs professor we'd love to have him he's always welcome in here uh the rustic taylor hawks bay one that was there yes. was a tunnel but you couldn't drive in it right or uh could you? you could yeah you oh. could oh. i think that was on the almost a farm side i got you interesting hawks bay was the other one i couldn't remember the name of it yeah hawks bay yeah 
Almost a rustic Taylor Hawks Bay, wasn't it? Or something like yep. that? That's it. Yeah. Almost a rustic Taylor's Hawks Bay. Yeah, there you go. I'll come run over here for a minute. I don't know. I feel like knocking out the little part. I probably should, uh, let's say, of course, play the truck, but by the time we move, like, you know, we'll have to drive so far to get to it. Mm hmm. Train. Oh, oh. Knock this little part out and get her done. I have no idea what our uh, next map. We usually don't start looking until it's like, hey, we kind of need a map, you know? Because I feel like if we picked a map right now, and especially if it was a map I was like really into, I'd just want to go play it. But I, I'm into this map too, you know? Like, I want to play here. And so I feel like it would kind of ruin the experience here, you know? That makes sense? So. That's kind of why I don't like picking maps until we are almost ready for a map. Like, within a week or two. Mm hmm. So. Peasant Vale had a massive tunnel system. Yeah, it's where we, like, sold all the cotton. Got lost in there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was crazy. Oh, Nook's another good map. It's another great map. Only if the trees are easier to cut down. Mm hmm. <laughs> And of course, Madison County is a fantastic map as well. It's on my, on the higher end of my uh, map list for sure. I can say it was already my favorite map. And then when they came back and finished it, it's just amazing. Yeah. Yep. I know I get, I get hit in the nostalgia every time I uh, am able to catch part of your stream map. I still want you to go back and play it. Cause you stream it too early, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Play two more maps before 22? Uh, yeah, probably. I mean, we have like five months, so. Sandy Bay, that's a good map, too. Um, think of that map with auto drive and course play working together, Matt. Oh. Hmm. Mm. That could be something. I don't know if I want to take on another, like, let's play right now. I don't think I'd want to stream that, you know? Yeah. Because, again, it's a 4X map. I don't like putting those on servers anymore. Millennial Farm. Millennial map's great. I'm, I've been really enjoying that one, too. I really have been. See, what I would have to do... This is going to be kind of cheaty. I don't know if I can do this or not with Farm Sim. I know, like, with my editing program, I can open it through Steam. But I can open it on both computers at the same time. Because mm -hmm. if I could open farm sim on both computers and log one into, say, Millennials map and say one into Farms of Madison County and let course play run on both computers, then I might be tempted to do it. Because I'm definitely not playing without course play and, well, now without, without auto drive. I'd definitely have to run both. I really like both, as especially working together for, like, picking up straw and stuff. Oh, I can't get any better. So nice. Because I definitely play like a lot different than say how you are, Matt. There's nothing wrong with either way, you know? Mm -hmm. I should go back and play my favorite map as the last drop. Well, that would probably be Farms of Madison County, so. Yeah. Close it out with a bang. Yeah, I need Leonard to map it auto drive for me. <laughs> uh, can you imagine if I did an auto drive for over a whole map? How like everything would just be named like really off, like really badly, you know? It'd be terrible. Frank, hill... you need a motorcycle just to get down the driveway. And his Irish map. And his Irish. He's all about that Irish map. Yeah. That hill is so aggressive, I can't come by it, man. Like, my header's too far off the ground coming up the hill. Oh. <laughs> Got a little side pass here. We'll begin. All right, so half the truck's full, by the way. 
Because we okay. fill one hopper. Or not quite full, I guess. I wasn't quite full. Close, though. Very, very close. I don't know. I don't know if I want to... I'd have to... Before I commit to playing that again, Farms in Madison County, I'd have to see if I can open Farms in one two computers. The only thing that would suck is, like, my auto drive config. I'd have to be swapping that back and forth all the time. So, like, if I made a course on one computer, I'd have to swap that auto drive config to the other one, you know? Which is not hard to do. You loaded the same mods on the computer. Steam saves a cloud backup. You can pull that cloud back up down to your local. Yeah, yeah, no, the save game wouldn't be a problem. It's the auto drive, right? Yeah. I would, wouldn't it save the courses, though, with all that data? Because it saves the entire uh, folder. It might, yeah. It'd be something to try. For sure. It'd be something to try. Leonard, you're up. <laughs> Leonard, I'm going to need a favor. <laughs> I mean, I could do it. There's really not how many cell points. There's only like three or four, isn't there? No, they added some. Oh, did they? Uh, Dang. let's see. Well, there was Miller's and the Guard Illinois Mill. Okay. Now there's um, Made Best, which is like sugar, sugar beets and potatoes. Okay. I'll and then there's the Helen Coop or something like that. Oh. Yes. Hey, Seth, Father, appreciate you all. Come on in. How's it going? I would definitely bring some variety to my day streams. I'd still be playing farm sim, but mm -hmm. I'd be able to maybe not play this map as much and play uh, play that. Because everybody knows there's a lot of potential that you can do on that map, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm not committing to anything right now, chat. Not doing it. Because that's a lot of hours, you know? A lot of hours to run that map. Make it? Am I going to make it? Just cutting trees down is like... Because, of course, I have to customize the fields, you know? I would have to do that again. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, no. I'm going to it to the end. Play it hardcore? No. <laughs> no. If I'm playing Madison County, I'm using, like, you know, OP combine and... Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, thanks for that follow as well. Appreciate you. Welcome on in. How's it going, guys? At least like the X9 and maybe like the 9250. X9 would be really good, yeah. You know, maybe the uh, uh, DB120. Mm -hmm. That's great. I'd love that planner. Love it. I got, a, I got a good one for you, too. Yeah. Thanks for that follow as well. Appreciate it, guys. Welcome in, everybody. How y'all doing? I got the one from the Mod Hub. I, li I like it. Kind of low in capacity. Uh, when you course play, though, it doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you can set it to matter, but it doesn't matter. Are you feeling the auger wagon at all? Or? I hadn't yet. I mean, you can. It'll, yeah. I was hoping we'd have another uh, person to drive that. But that's okay. They're good. Howdy, guys. Welcome. Art economy, maybe seasons are precision. Oh, I have to. <laughs> not precision. No. This is not bad if you have the add on. Nope. What add on? The add on where you don't have to probe the ground. Oh, no, no more soil samples? Yeah, no more soil samples. What's the point of precision then? Just like real life, where you pay somebody to come do it. Ah, true. I they have uh, that in the game. I, I hope they have the ability to turn it off in twenty two. Right. I don't mind precision, but you know, you got to think. Like, if I start this let's play tomorrow, if I if I record episode one tomorrow, which I'm not saying I'm going to because I'm not, but. I record episode one tomorrow. I have less than five months to try to finish the map. Mm -hmm. Dude, it's Madison County. It takes forever. Okay. Yeah. Like, there's no way. Then but, you got to cut down all the trees and then combine the fields. Yeah. 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 Trust me. I know. I mean, I don't have to, but that's totally how I would play that map again. 
Well, you know, this guy stopped by our farm wearing like a 10 gallon hat and you know, he, he said he was from Texas. Right. And, uh -huh. um, uh, works in the oil industry. Oh, they have a lot and, of money. Yeah. He, he invested in our farm. See? Okay. So. Uh, those icons on the side of my screen. Yes. Those are a mod. That is our guidance steering mod. So basically GPS, it is in the mod hub and it is called guidance steering PC only PC only. Uh, our version has been tweaked slightly, but it's basically the same as uh, the one that's in there. Hoping the console people get it in, in November. Hopefully. Straw harvest. Oh, man. See. I don't like straw harvest at all. So first thing you have to do for guidance steering is hit alt and C. And that turns your satellite dish green and then hit control and S brings up your whole menu. And probably what you're going to want to do is just set your A point and then drive a little bit and set an A point or B, a B point. And then you want to hit your auto with probably don't want an offset. So you hit that there to get rid of offset. Uh, you can turn your lines on and off basically the rough rundown. So yeah. Rox, have you met him too? Oil and Baron, is that who? Wait. I think you that's his occupation, not his name. You found him too? Yeah. Wow. I think that's his occupation. I thought that joke died like four years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I know, he was just passing through and wanted to invest in the farm. So He's he like, howdy, y'all. Yeah, it was a 10 gallon drum hat or whatever. Wow. Like, okay. Kind of look like that dude from Curious George, you know? The man in the yellow hat? Uh-huh. What is his name? He was a little fatter. What um, is... I don't know. Because, I mean, George is the monkey, obviously. Yeah. I don't know. Did he have um, a name? Is it Mr. Oh. Magoo? No, that was a blind guy. Where's Mr. Magoo from? He's the blind guy. Yeah, he's a blind guy, I thought. Blind guy? Yeah, the cartoon, yeah. you know, yeah, he's blind as a bat and... Can't see. They made a movie with Leslie Nielsen about him. Oh. Your grandma's an oil baron. Hey, Pepper, I need uh, I need your grandma's phone number, my guy. How old is she? <laughs> Does she like pizza? <laughs> Does she have her yard mode? Oh. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I mean, as long as she likes pizza, you know. <laughs> Even the age thing doesn't matter. Nah. I mean, kind of does. Kind of not. Same time. Uh, the, the pizza is the most important thing. She's got to like pizza. <laughs> Old. <laughs> oh, Pepper. Just kidding, bro. It's a prank, man. It's a prank, bro. I'm always on the lookout for a sugar mama. I mean, I wouldn't be opposed to it. Nope. Like, at all. Oh, she lets me play farm sim and eat pizza. I mean, pretty sick. Yeah. Set, yeah. You know? real and then matter pepper <laughs> oh man conversation just got weird and here we were you know talking about pine nuts earlier for like an hour and that wasn't weird <laughs> kind of weird this, make, this makes that less weird <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird conversation Saying. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, they have all the animals, huh? Rocks. Oh, great. I love World War II. I watch stuff about that all the time on YouTube. Oh, you guys Matt, she's like World old, War old. Huh? Bro, bro, she's like so old, you old. Through, <laughs> you go through the uh, World War II rabbit hole on YouTube? Uh, probably. He's like, he's like old, old then, huh? saying wow I mean, my grandpa was in world war ii maybe she knew him maybe actually okay this is gonna sound really weird there's this i'm assuming it's his granddaughter it does all like the tiktoking but this this world war ii veteran and he they make videos of him on tiktok and he talks to the camera and whatnot right mm -hmm. 
he was in the Battle of the Bulge. And yep. my my grandpa was in the Battle of the Bulge. So was mine. Really? Yep. Was your grandpa my grandpa? Wait. Mm -hmm. Were we related? And uh, I I don't know like even what platoon he was in or anything. I don't know any of that stuff. But I would love to try to figure that out and then contact and be like, did you know him? Like, how crazy would that be, you know? Better hurry because it's kind of, you know. Yeah, I know, right? Time's running out. It would just be kind of weird to hear like somebody that, I don't know. I'm sure he wouldn't, but it'd be kind of crazy. You know, you can find their, uh, like their, uh, their cards and their orders online. Oh, can you? I'm yeah. sure, I'm sure first time knows all that is like the genealogy stuff he does. Mm -hmm. But like I, I've never known any of that. And really, there, were a couple of years before my grandma died, we were at where she was living, and she had this this good sized box that had every newspaper clipping, every letter he sent home, every everything from the war, pictures, all kinds of stuff. And uh, I don't know where any of that is now. I, hopefully my uncle like didn't just trash all that stuff. Because I'm pretty sure he, he's the one that has it. So, A lot of memories there. A lot of, a lot of history, you know, for the family kind of thing, you know. Mm -hmm. Like, my grandpa's, like, uh, what's it called? Like, his, uh, like, boot camp picture. Like, his whole group at boot camp. Mm -hmm. And then there's actually one of his dad. Same thing at boot camp. His dad was in the, uh, the Navy, I believe. Grandpa was in the army. So, kind of crazy. But I don't, I don't know where any of that stuff is. Hopefully, hopefully my uncle didn't like do something stupid with all that. Carson, you can stop with the pizza. You know? Oh, don't worry. I went and ended up mowing it instead of getting pizza. Oh, did you? But it's getting delivered right now, so okay. I'm okay. I'm waiting for the snap. I really am. Yeah. <laughs> It ended, I was going to go out there, and then, like, they weren't out there. Like, my parents weren't out there, and then I was like, oh, it's trash, but I go mow, and then I went and mowed. The pizza, or the snap that I'm not going to open till later? Yeah, probably, actually, yeah. Yeah, I'm waiting for it. Well, it's not here yet. So what'd you get? What'd you order? I don't, I wasn't home when they ordered it. Oh. And I don't have to go get it, because I was mowing. Hashtag mystery pizza, huh? I bet I can tell you what it is, though. Probably, like, stuffed crust, pepperoni? Probably, like, stuffed Stuffed crust, meat lovers, and then a stuffed crust cream, probably. You had meat stuffed crust? I haven't had Domino's in like, or not Domino's. He's had it in like two years, three years, maybe. That's pretty much the only thing that I like from there. They have, ours has a, a pretty good sandwich, but. It's the only um, good one in town. All the other ones are just like. Yeah, ours has a sandwich and you can get fries with it. Whatever, whatever you order, uh, you might get a side crack with another one or the other one. You just dump like more grease than like all of them. See, that's on. the problem with our pizza hut here. It is just pure grease. Yeah, the yeah, other there's one local one like downtown, downtown, downtown. It's like the, it's like there's like a big row that goes through town where all like the restaurants and stuff are, but that's not downtown. It's like okay. downtown, downtown, downtown. There's one down there, and it's like. Man, yeah, I'm you may as well eat it. Might eat it with a fork. I, there's nothing wrong with a good fork pizza. Hmm? The pizza I make is a fork pizza. You eat that with a fork. And a straw. <laughs> uh, not that, but yeah. Does anybody remember the Blake Shelton Smokehouse Barbecue Pizza? No. That was the absolute best barbecue pizza you oh, could yeah. have, and it was from Pizza Hut, yeah. Oh. Huh. They just Casey's continued had it. a uh, barbecue pizza. This one was, it had, I don't know what, I can't remember what all it had on it, but, and it was the bee's knees. Oh, cool. Something has been shipped from Amazon. Good. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Lansing, Michigan, in that area, 55, an hour ago, had five tornado warnings kind of stacked in each other. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. The only good pizza around rocks is Casey's, dude. It's so good. Casey's pizza, man. Well, uh, cause it's Casey's. We, uh, 
We've you been... should have Casey make you a pizza. I like, should. Hey, it's Casey's pizza. <laughs> get just like a, a sharpie and write on like a plain box. Like on like a like a open box from yeah. Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> like X out the X out the Amazon, Amazon stuff and, and just write, write Casey's. <laughs> Let's go. Um. Okay, sorry.